Welcome back, everybody, to EA Sports. James Sabalski and Ray Ferraro along for the action, and two teams that just simply hate one another are ready to collide. We are about set to drop the puck as both centers make their way into the dot. The Penguins take possession here on the opening draw, and we are underway. Quick pass to Davidson. Oh, what a stop with the paddle! Oh, they do it again! Yeah, he's right in front of the puck, too, so there's really nowhere that puck's gonna squeak through. In all alone, on the breakaway! Oh, what a stop on the one-on-one! -on -one. What a great play to get in on the goaltender all by himself, but turned away with an excellent save. Sends the pass over. Across the line from center. Just a simple save by Dorio. There's the whistle as things will slow down here for a moment. Always a good play if you're not sure what's going on. Freeze the puck. Still plenty of time left in this frame. We're still scoreless. The Hornets won a big draw on their own end. Fadoon's got the puck in his own zone. And now it's grabbed by Joseph. He carries the puck up. Oh, boy. Sends it in deep. Pass to Molson. From the left side, they enter the offensive zone. Right on the doorstep. Let's it fly. Stones him with the blocker. I thought they worked the puck around pretty good. Here they get a good chance on goal, but not to be. And that's blocked. Feeds it up ahead. Quick feed to Alexiev. From center, they get into the attacking area. Let's it go. Oh, what a stop. Scores right on the doorstep. He pounces on the rebound and puts it home. You want money, you go to the bank. You want bread, you go to the store. You want goals, you get into the net. The rebound's there, he puts it away. The Bears tally the game's first goal. And you get yourself into the middle part of the period. This is where the game starts to take shape, and now they've got the lead. Slides it across to Gruden. Good battle along the boards for the puck. Johansson's taking it from his own end. Johnson Fjellby's got it along the boards. Turns it aside with the glove. In front of the net, the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. Well past the midway mark of this period, we got a 1-0 game to this point. The Bears win it. And now he moves it quickly to Johansson. What a stop as he puts out the fire! He can get rid of the puck in a hurry. I think that's one of the reasons he's in the top 10 in goals in this league. He doesn't need many chances. Officials are in position, and both teams are getting ready as they get set for another face-off here. Into the offensive zone. Heads to the back of the net. Takes the feed from his netminder. Great defensive effort with the stick. The Bears gain possession. And that's wow. taken away in the offensive end by Gruden. Moves it to Pilon. Takes the feed. Blocked in front. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Handles it along the blue line. Takes a shot. Just wide. Rinky's lugging the puck. Intercepted in the offensive end by Pilon. And they can't connect. The Bears will play the puck from behind the net. Off the bar. I think that caught the inside of the post. Taken along the wall by Gruden. The Penguins play it along the boards. Here's a shot and makes the save. Great poke check on the reach. Drives to the crease. Stopped by the goaltender. These are frustrating. You don't get many chances like this. I thought he made a good shot, but the goalie, an excellent stop, beats the shooter. And with the buzzer, that puts a bow on the first 20 minutes of play. We've got lots more still to come. Second period action next, right here. Hey, fans, don't forget to enter tonight for our team side. Both teams had a chance to recharge. 
And the official set to drop the puck here on period number two. Hershey's won it. The Bears have it now. Takes it across the blue line. Hangs on to the puck. How did he stop that one? Really good work. I like this chance here as they get the puck into a scoring spot. Goal is just better on this time. Lots of time left in this period. 1-0 the score. The Bears take possession off the faceoff. Takes the shot. Oh, he got a little sliver of it, and it stays out. Puck grabbed by Leeson. He scores! Lights the lamp on the one-timer! The good thing he one-times his puck. The goalie almost gets there, but the pass is on his tape in the low slot, and he beats him clean. Hershey's now made their way back to center ice for the faceoff. I see a lot of movement, a lot of talking on the bench right now. What's the message, right? Coaches are going up and down the bench, telling the players to stay on it. Don't back up. The Bears are on the attack. Taken by Leeson. Fires it on net. That goes off a twig. Nylander's been brought down, and we're going to get a penalty here. Slides it on over to Savorna. Time for the official to pass down his sentence. Oh, I hated that, James. As soon as you make this play, you know your next stop is into the penalty box. Guys, this power play, as we know, is ranked toward the bottom of the league. But that's not for us to remind them of. That's the coach's job. They've got a huge opportunity here. We know they've been working hard. Let's see if they can put that work to the test. And they get the puck out. Scooped up along the wall by Persich. And they'll be forced to tag up after that missed pass. Puts it in deep. The Penguins gain control of the puck against the wall. Gains the zone through the middle. Receives the pass. Stopped by the goaltender. He got a little piece of that one. And they send it down the ice. Grabs the puck and moves on out here with this man advantage. Wilkesbury Scranton's got it in their own zone. Skates to the crease. Back to the net. They score. I like the way they use that manpower advantage to their advantage. They move the puck quickly. The penalty killers just couldn't catch up. Wilkesbury Scranton's got new life here in this second period, Ray. It's amazing what a goal does. The energy on the bench changes. Guys can't wait to get on for their next shift. Vecchioli's got it in the offensive zone. Here's a shot. Oh, it stays out. He got a piece of that one. Great read by Vecchioli. Denied by the goaltender. He scores! Well, this shaping up to be a long night for the goaltenders here. Yeah, if you're in the backup goalie position, I'd say start stretching because there's no end to this in sight. Ha! Huh. Better to be lucky than good. This thing bounces around and somehow evades the goaltender. I don't even really know how that ended up in the net. The Bears make their way back to center ice here with now a two-goal lead in the second. Nice to pad the one-goal lead. They played well, and now they've earned this spot in the game. Grabbed along the boards by Alexiev. Great pressure to force the turnover by Davidson. Blocked in traffic. Hershey's got the puck. Puck picked up by Protus. Can't connect on the pass. Enters the offensive zone from the left. And they get the puck out of the defensive end. Picked up along the wall by Janssen Fialbi. Puck scooped up by Leeson. Now a quick pass to Alexiev. Aaron pass and they can't connect. And reads the play perfectly and picks off the pass. Takes a shot with the stop. The Bears gain possession along the wall. Slides the puck into the offensive zone. Turned aside with the glove by Dorio. And as he opts to freeze the puck, we get a whistle. Starting to look like a little bit of a fire drill in the zone, so this is a good play. Past the midway mark of the frame, James and Ray with you tonight. The Bears have recently taken a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. 
Scarposis won the draw here in the offensive zone. And the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. Here's a short pass to Gruden. He got all of that one. Hershey's got the puck in their own end. Devastating collision into the boards. Moves it quickly over to Fadoon. Denies him! Fukali's surprised a lot of people over his career with some of the saves he makes. Now, this isn't the best one ever. But man, this is a beauty. It surprised me. I didn't think he was going to get it. And now it's grabbed by Gruden. Turns it aside. Quick pass to Leeson. The Bears looking against the half wall. Hershey's got the puck along the boards. Answered the call there. And the middle frame almost done. Drogues carrying it ahead. Here he, he scores! Wilkes-Barre Scranton's got one back late in the second. How does that change things now, Ray? From their bench, it seems like they're pretty excited. They jumped up, they're loud, they're ready to go as they try to find the equalizer. And no luck on that pass attempt. We got a penalty coming up here on the play. Well, two periods down and one more still to come. Third period action right after we get a clean sheet of ice. Look for our food donation boxes located throughout the concourse. Guys, after this power play was able to capitalize on their first opportunity of the night, they're looking like a more confident group. We know they're ranked toward the bottom of the league, but if they can just do what they did already, they can get it done here tonight. Trying to get it out of their own end. And it's a small victory for the PK unit here. Well, it's their job. Get it down the ice, get off the ice, get some new people out there. Rocked on the play. Puck cleared from the defensive end. Makes it look easy with the stop. Quick feed to Sohorna. That pass doesn't go. Grabs control of it at the point. Score! Short-handed! A backbreaker of a goal! Man, does that pump your bench up, and you can imagine what the other guy's bench is like, flat as a pancake, giving up the shorty. What a great release on this one. There's room right over the glove. He sticks it in the top of the net. Hershey's goal here early in the third has now given themselves a two-goal lead. Coaches are pretty happy with this start. You come out of the intermission leading by one, and you tell your team, get after it, be aggressive. They were, and now they lead by two. Stop that one. Quick shot. Denies him in close. Pushes it across to Shapu. And he slides it quickly to Nylander. Takes the puck as the clock ticks down on the penalty kill. Vecchioni's coaches want to get him back on the ice. When you see a player that's feeling it like this, James, he's got to go back and get into the game. Hershey's got a hold of the puck now. The Penguins look to start the transition game. Wilkes-Barre Scranton's moving it into the offensive end. Gets some big air, but this ain't skiing, Racer. Nah, he's trying to get right up underneath the bar, trying to get it over the goaltender's shoulders, but just elevates it a little bit too much. Wilkes-Barre Scranton's coaches will not be liking that power play opportunity as they fail to convert and give up a shorthanded one. Well, that doesn't go according to plan. The power play's done, and they've given up a shorty. Those are always deflating. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. Hershey's got a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. Wilkes-Barre Scranton's looking to break out. And that's deflected. Here's a shot. Big time stop there. And he slides it quickly to Johansson. Shot on net. Buries it for the goal. I always wanted to have a fast start. It's funny, you go no goals in three games in the middle of the year, nobody cares. At the start, it really matters.
player in front of the net. It's a screen if you can. This time it's just about perfect. I don't think the goaltender ever picks it up. Hershey's added to their lead here in this third period. It's been non-stop. I like how they've scored and then gone after the next one, James. They've had their foot down on the gas pedal the whole night. Broken up in the neutral zone by Bill Reed. From the slot, wrist shot. Hershey's got possession of the puck. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. And that pass can't connect. Wilkesbury scrams on the attack. Hershey's got a hold of it along the wall. Takes the feed at center and moves up ahead. And a great save! The Penguins will play it in their own end. Moves it to Trosk. Here comes the pushback. There's the whistle stopping the play and get a better spot down the hatches. They're going to go here. Yeah, I thought we'd get a few of these tonight. Here's another. Well, listen to this place. They expected it and they got it. Yeah, it wasn't if. It was going to be when this fight was going to happen. That's the first sign of life they've had in quite some time. They're getting their lunch handed to them tonight. Well, this crowd's still in a bit of a frenzy after what we just witnessed moments ago. Both teams lining up for the faceoff. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Molson's moving it ahead. Handles the puck. Off the glove. And it's a quick pass to Devane. Moves it around along the half wall. The Bears scoop it up along the boards. Here's a shot. Let's see what the officials are calling. This is always a fine line penalty. You're allowed a little interference, just not that much. Power play unit going back to work. Most power plays I was on, James, we were all greedy. If you had one or two earlier in the game, you wanted three or four. It never lays down. And that's another power play marker. Oh, the power play coach is going to be pumped here. They had done some extra work on the power play over the last 10 days or so. Really paying off tonight. Wilkesbury Scranton still got to find two more goals, but they at least have one back. That gives them a little bit of hope, and the bench seems to have come alive a little bit. Here's a shot. Shuts him down. Picked up along the boards by Vecchioni. Oh, and that stays out with the toe save. Wilkesbury Scranton's in transition. Here's a short pass to Davidson. Wow, oh, he got hit. James, there's nowhere to go sometimes. You know you're going to get it. You just have to take the hit. Routine save made by Dorio. Takes the feed. Here's a shot! Stopped by Piccoli! Sends it over to Scarbosa. Makes his presence known on the ice. The Bears get a hold of the puck along the boards. Sends a pass over. Moves the puck. Stopped by the goaltender. Takes the pass from his goaltender. Moves it quickly over to Nylander. Hershey's got a great luxury here. This second line is really playing well tonight, so they can go game to game, and whoever's the hottest line, they can really ride. Here's a sprint for the loose puck. Nice job to escape the zone. Centering pass in front, and that one's broken up. The Penguins move it in. He's got a step. Massive save on the breakaway. Well, he stayed with the shooter there. That's an outstanding pressure-filled save. Icing is the call. We'll get a face up at the other end. The Bears are on the save the date calendar next for these guys. Yeah, fans of both teams will really look forward to that matchup. It's generally a pretty aggressive game. Never an off night in this league. Wilkesbury Scranton's got it, and they're on the attack. That was an important face off, James. Now they got an offensive zone possession. Oh, what a slick stop by Piccoli! Gets it out of his own end. Long pass across the ice. Hard 
Oh, oh, on the plane. Wow, did he ever finish him hard. And when he dropped, he also dropped his stick. Now he's got to collect himself. Looks like a yard sale out there. There's the final horn, and that'll do it here this evening. They've got all the answers right now. The winning streak continues as they find a way to win again. There's the old cliche, right? Good teams find ways to win. Bad teams find ways to lose. They can't do anything wrong these no, days. Now, when there's a turning point, James, they find a way to be on the positive side of it. In the meantime and in between time, he's Ray. I'm James. Good night.